I want to talk about a movie, a very special movie that is coming to Montreal for the February 3rd movie night event put on by Federation CJA. It's hosted by them. This is a Canadian exclusive premiere screening. The film opens in theaters in May, but you can be first to see this. And we talk about it because it's one of those rom-coms, you know, romantic comedies that I want to talk about. And we fortunately have the director with us who will actually be at the event to he'll be making a guest appearance to do a Q&A after the film and mingle with all the guests and just before we get to John and talk to him it will be uh, February 3rd again put on by hosted by Federation CJA it takes place at the Colisee Kirkland and I believe it is at uh, 7 p.m. Um, I I don't have the right here, the exact dates, but anyhow, you can certainly find more information at federationcja.org for their movie night. So let's talk to the director, John Burgess of One Small Hitch. Hi, John. Hi, Dr. Laurie. Thank you for having me. Well, thanks for uh, being on the program for a couple minutes and telling us about this movie. Saw some of the preliminary, um, you know, descriptions and it looks like a lot of fun. Tell us, can you give us a little bit without giving away too, too much? Sure. Yeah, it is. It's a lot of fun, and we had a blast making it. So I really think that shows through in the performances and up on the screen. Uh, It's about two childhood friends that fake a wedding engagement to make a dying father happy. (laughs) Um, So it looks and feels a lot like uh, an early John Hughes or Cameron Crowe film from the 80s. Okay. Uh, So the way I've been describing it to people because it's about two people that are faking a wedding engagement, is that it's kind of like my big fat Greek wedding meets the proposal meets 16 <laughs> candles. If you take those films and you throw them into a blender, you get one small. All three great films. That's fantastic. <laughs> yeah, and it's, uh, it's got a real family feel. There's definitely a lot of sex and love. Uh, it's mm-hmm. mostly applied to sexual situations. There's nothing <laughs> graphic by any means, so it's appropriate for a PG-13 audience. Right. John, is it, is it a true well. story, John? <laughs> no, the, the writer is actually a very good friend of mine. His name's Jody Levinson. Okay. Uh, he's Jewish, and I'm Irish. Okay. Uh, so when I came onto the project, Jody had all of the crazy Jewish family members down pat. Um, <laughs> the Irish people were a little bit off, so I made them a little bit more feisty and uh, scrappy. Why is And uh, that's what it is. One family is Jewish, and the other one is Irish. Oh, and the uh, children knew each other forever in Chicago growing up. Okay. They moved out to Los Angeles. They're coming back to Chicago for uh, the female character's mother is getting remarried, and the male character finds out that his dad is dying of cancer. He basically says, I only have one regret. It would be if, you know, I'm going to leave this world without meeting the woman who you're eventually going to end up with. <laughs> so that's where the lie concocts from, and uh, it just snowballs from there, and the family members start going crazy, so that's when they have to start planning this phony wedding. And then there's other girls and guys that come into the picture, so it just kind of keeps spiraling. And that's really where all the humor comes from, right. is a lot of uh, miscommunication and people thinking what's not really going on. It's so exciting uh, that it's opening uh, in May, but we get to see it way ahead of time. I love it. Yeah, I think it's going to be June now. Now we're looking at June Father's Day theme, okay. uh, a June 15th or 13th release. No, but it's going to start out with limited theatrical release in the United States. Mm-hmm. Uh, but I can guarantee that it will be available on uh, VOD and pay-per-view for sure in Canada, but it's going to depend on how the limited theatrical release. We did really well in the festival circuit, so that's where this limited theatrical release is coming from. The film's won 11 awards, a lot of Best wow. Picture comedies. I got, won a couple of Best Directors, a Rising Star wow. Award. We took Best Play at the Los Angeles Comedy Film Festival. We took Best Ensemble Cast here in uh, the Chicago at the Chicago Comedy Film Festival. Wow. So that's awesome. It's done, uh, it's done nice. You should be very, very proud. And I'm so I'm I'm actually I bought my tickets already, so I will be there and I look forward to meeting you in person. Oh great, yeah, me too. The uh I've never been to Canada. What? So this is a exciting trip for me. <laughs> Both that I get to come and meet everyone. I love to do Q and A's. Well it's, uh, we'll have to show you around, John. Montreal's a great oh, place. Oh yeah, I could do the tour guide. That would be great. Okay. All right, you're well, on. Don't. 
long as you don't grill me about any of my dating past. <laughs> oh, <laughs> hey, you can hang on and you can talk about your dating past on our dating dilemmas. We're actually oh, talking God, about now, insecurities. Now my Q&A, <laughs> now my Q&A is going to be more interesting. That'll be fun. <laughs> I'm sure it will. That's awesome. John, thank you so much, and we'll see you. The event starts at 6.30 p.m. on February 3rd, the movie night at Colise Kirkland. Can't wait to see it. Really looking okay, forward to great. it. All right, John. Thank you, Thanks. Dr. Bye. John Burgess, he is the director of One Small Hitch, the Canadian exclusive premiere screening right here in Montreal, in Kirkland. It is hosted by Federation CJA. Every year they put on this amazing movie night. There's always a movie that's exclusively here. And this one is a romantic comedy. Looks great. Saw the previews. Looks amazing. And it only opens in June, so you get a chance to see it. If you would like to go, you can always go to the website, federationcja.org, and you can find the information right there. That's federationcja.org. Org. Everyone is welcome. Uh, tickets are $25, but you get a supper, snacks, treats, door prizes, giveaways, a dessert reception following the screening, and you get to meet the director, uh, John Burgess, who we just spoke to. So for 25 bucks, that's a pretty damn good deal, actually. Uh, a lot cheaper than going to the movies regularly and buying your movie ticket and your popcorn and your drink. Right, sounds Frank? Like, sounds like a great <laughs> location for a first date. Yeah, exactly. Hey, what a great idea. There you go. Uh, so that's um, that's a lot of fun. One Small Hitch is the romantic comedy. I love those.